Thank you that you come so far away. Sometimes very uh, too long trip to go to the Krakow. Uh, sometimes only three hours or <laughs> one hour uh, in traffic. Uh, my name is Paweł Frankowski. Uh, I started my adventure with uh, Joomla from the Mambo. So, but Joomla stole my heart, so I'm here now. Uh, about self-introduction. Uh, I started publishing books about Joomla, oh, it was so many years ago. As you see, uh, right now we have about, uh, in general, about eight books about Joomla since now. Uh, I hope it is a great uh, number, maybe, maybe it will be more soon, <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, I'm the active member of Polish community, I'm trying to help people as, as I have time. Uh, my life motto is start where you are, use what you have and do what you can. Uh, it's like survival uh, motto as well. Uh, I will talk today about common problems and solutions or solutions like, like one. Uh, we will talk about uh, past and the future and the uh, current times. Maybe start from the beginning or maybe Asian, Asian times. A uh, long time ago when I started, uh, my first boss asked me to create a uh, first website based, of course, on paper advertisement brochure. It was, of course, HTML only. Uh, it was great times for all uh, webmasters because Internet Explorer was the only uh, main browser, so life was easy. <laughs> uh, of course, the HTML editor was with the keyboard. I was the number two uh, for all the webmasters in these times. Uh, it was great times, but because the creating websites it was magic. Nobody knows how to spell it and what you are doing, you know, because you are using only code. And code looks like magic for all the people, even now. Um, next year, we, we all webmasters discovered the new toys or tools, as you can call it. Uh, front page, Dreamweaver, Artista, uh, some of uh, our people are using right now our work us as well. Uh, have you ever thought why? Uh, I think because it was fun, because you can see what you created and it was uh, not so hard for even for the beginners to create a website and not boring adding code line by line. All right? Uh, let's start about Joomla adventure. Uh, why users love Joomla right now? Because they don't have to write code, HTML code, sometimes CSS code as well anymore. They just installing CMS and clicking. Uh, let's talk about the problems which are still common um, of the beginners. For example, first Beginners use why hate Joomla because they have so many choices and the choices are not always the good one. For example, let's let's talk, let's see uh, about see the slider shot. For example, for the Joomla we have uh, over 300 slider shot models. It is horrible number, and if you are a beginner, you don't want to uh, take take time to choose the one, the great one. You want to choose just the slider show, and if you have so many uh, available uh, solutions, you don't know which one is the best for you or the, or the best all the time. Uh, don't worry, of course, WordPress users have even more uh, words in this case. Uh, I think uh, number of extension is, is sometimes good and sometimes is bad. Uh, but it depends, of, of course, on the people who are using Joomla or any other uh, from, uh, CMS. Problem number two, quality of code. Because everyone can be a developer, uh, sometimes the front end is, looks much, much better than back end. So, and for, for example, for the beginners, it is not possible to check quality of the code. And the problem is because if you are installing many, many modules, sometimes too much, 
some of them can have uh, security issues, bugs, so someone can hack your site. Uh, the main third, third problem is model can be terrible, especially for the beginners, because if they build their own site or they, they grab site, site from the uh, developers, they see, for example, 50 models and they are afraid which one is for, for what, what they are doing, uh, why they some are in the uh, position they are don't understand, some are disabled, and this is sometimes can be terrible, even for us, with lo long, long experience. Um, fourth problem is conflict between extensions, because if you are, have one extension, from no, not, not core, uh, it's no problem. But if you have more, sometimes use it. The odd one, uh, the jQuery plus uh, Moodles can, can conflict between them, and, and it doesn't work very well. Sometimes slider shop doesn't work, uh, tabs are not open, different, different, different problems. Uh, you have to pay for each extension separately, of course, if you have, want to use the uh, premium uh, components or modules sometimes, and this is not good because uh, you pay for, for um, solution from different developers and the quality code can be different sometimes uh, if you pay and get the product but it's not okay uh, but you cannot uh, get a uh, refund. Sixth problem, uh, website reframes are static. Uh, I think this problem because uh, if you're creating a website which doesn't look uh, even doesn't look bad, good, but it's, it cannot be clicked every, uh, or you can't uh, do anything with this. Um, the client can be disappointed because he want, he don't want to see the uh, uh, wireframes of the paper. He wants to see the live site, uh, probably in short time. It is possible, of course. Uh, sometimes the. Uh, template is the problem of his limitation because he has only four or six, maybe sometimes ten, uh, model positions, and you cannot add more if you if you are a beginner or you are afraid to change something in the code. Uh, our company about eating the pizza sometimes uh, and think about which solution can be so uh, can put all the things together tools. Uh, which you are using uh, in common and tasty pieces like page builder. We created a tool which is called page builder. Uh, it's a tool which can be uh, this is component and include model as well and allows you to create um, pages without using any models. Of course you can use it. Uh, this is great tool also to create mockups. Uh, or wireframes or small pages, especially if your client is limited with his knowledge. Um, this is the basic uh, example of the layout in the backend. Uh, if you can see, uh, there are rows, and, and in, ro in each row there's columns or, or uh, add ons. Add ons, it's like similar to models, but this is uh, our uh, names. You can use uh, add-ons from our collections because we have over oh, almost 50 uh, add-ons right now. Or you can use a Joomla model as well if you are need any uh, any extensions like uh, advanced layer based on layers uh, sliders, for example. Uh, I think this is great uh, not only for the beginners as, uh, but also for designers because they don't have to. Uh, over light, over uh, right. uh, the models, they, they only want to, uh, they need to uh, override these add-ons if they want or just use CSS to create um, different, different appearance. Uh, in the pro version, uh, you doesn't have to worry about design uh, because you can use one of them. Uh, they are built in, so if you are a lazy boy or you have don't, don't have time or you can 
you see one of them is great for your uh, purpose or maybe uh, you can uh, talk with the client maybe he likes one of them or you want to create your own after after some time you can use one of them and get it in the few seconds after uh, choosing uh, one of them uh, is text, uh, text block. It can be replaced like uh, with articles because you don't have to use articles anymore. So of course you can. Uh, but sometimes, as you probably know, uh, in, the, in the site there is some limitation about uh, text you can add, uh, get from the client. So you don't have to use articles anymore. Uh, what is great also, as you see probably in the background, uh, this is uh, you can edit uh, page builder from the uh, front end. That's why uh, you can add uh, create an account from the client only for front end, and don't start please client back end just leave me alone and you can edit only this one if you want to change text just click it and you will be able client or you you can also change the number of columns and rows add a new one uh, change size of them it is quite basic if you have only mouse you don't have to use any uh, keyboard for this uh, you can create your own uh, number of, of columns and add uh, add-ons inside them. Uh, you can move uh, uh, dupli or duplicate, pastel, uh, everything, uh, starting from the add-ons, uh, ending from the pages, because sometimes you want to use the same page uh, on different uh, different pages, the same layout, and with different content. So it is very very easy. You can move on uh, these rows or add-ons from position to position which is very, very useful. Uh, we have the plans to improve even uh, this front end to make it, make, make it even better and faster because uh, if you are using new version of PHP, PHP this is okay, but sometimes users still use the old one and we have to improve it also in, in, for old PHP. And we hope that a uh, client will love it uh, if you sometimes, uh, if someone uh, saw the Concrete 5 CMS, it has very similar solution for years. Uh, it allows you to edit any content uh, in front end. This is uh, great uh, not only for uh, clients who are talking to, but also for the new clients to uh, improve your skills, to show them this is your skills is very, very high. Uh, Sometimes you don't have to use any models anymore and you can build all the layout based on uh, add-ons only. Uh, what is very important also, you can use Page Builder with any template. Uh, most popular are very, very uh, short on the screen. But of course you can uh, use your own custom uh, template as well. And there is no limitation to use uh, Page Builder free or pro version as well. So, uh, template is, is no limitation anymore if you want to add the columns or which are not in the basic layout. Uh, we can call it, this is page builder is one multi-tool, all in one as we can say it. Uh, some facts about this, uh, most cases as, as, I know, as I said before, you don't have to use any models, of course you can. Uh, uh, all code is from one developer, it means also better support and uh, the same level of quality of the code. So you don't have to worry that uh, one part will be different than, than another. You pay only once if you want, of course, per version only. Uh, you can add SL for the pages. Uh, it allows you to assign uh, edit to the pages or view only uh, to selected users. No more uh, JavaScript conflicts. Uh, front end additional, as I mentioned uh, before. Uh, you can use mouse or finger on your tablet to build the pages during conversation also with the client. Uh, I made it a few times in the past. 
and the client was surprised that I, in, during the conversation in the less than one hour, I was able to create the for him a web, completely website because in past you have to go this uh, the side should not be on the end on the back you can do it uh, during conversation face to face uh, it's no problem even to, to sit next to the client and uh, talk with him how he can see how you work and how he can be uh, involved in the future um, rows and add-ons can be disabled for example sometimes you are creating new rows uh, with the functionality for banners and you can disable it for the short period of time and enable it in, uh, for the future. Uh, content for mobile users only is no problem anymore because in default mobile, mobile uh, uh, models cannot be disabled for the mobile view and this using this solution you can hide the, some content from the tablet users on mobile, mobile with smartphone users it's, it's no problem anymore. Uh, Media Manager included as well. Uh, support for uh, J, JC Editor, which is very, very, very popular in current time. Uh, it can uh, increase the uh, editor uh, toolbar with the new features. Uh, you can use, of course, articles, uh, uh, for example, uh, Page, you can use page builder inside the articles, this is the first, and you can use page builder uh, as a model because the uh, model is also included. So you have very wide opportunity to use this tool. And as I showed before, they are pre-designed page layouts which can be used on any purpose. Of course, also for the commercial. And what the best part of the, the tool can, this is uh, playing with the blocks and skin, uh, still can be a magical for your clients because you don't have to show them this is using this or you can show them and this is any fun still like like in old times you can play with the blocks models are boring I think <laughs> any questions I will sorry that I cannot talk uh, show you uh, how it works but if you can tell me uh, on the break, I can show you how it works on the live, uh, so we can uh, enjoy <laughs> a page builder on the, on the local host, so no problem to show you how it works, how it can be moved uh, with the finger or the, or the mouse. I think this is all. Do you uh, think it's a good idea to show uh, your client that it's so easy to do? Uh, it do depends on the client. Yes. yes. I have one client who, which was very, very excited. And uh, he, he said that this, this was for, the, his, for the, him uh, the big experience to, uh, to take part to building a website. Mm -hmm. So, yes, it depends. Well, some of them could yes, say, oh, well, I'll do it by myself. Yes, why I have to pay you for the services? Yes, of course. Well, yeah, yes. Is this so is so easy, yes, of course. Uh, Polish but, experts. Yes, not, not only Polish. Not only Polish. Yes, but it depends, of course. Sometimes the clients uh, even ask, do you have any tools which can be helpful for my task? Because I don't want to spend many, many hours or uh, maybe money to edit my site. I will pay you, of course, for the solution. Um, oh, so yeah. sometimes you just uh, uh, recommend the yeah. solution and yes, exactly. show how it works. Yeah, and, and the end of yes. the cooperation, right? And no, maybe not end because uh, they need some support. Yes, of course, they still, they still. Lots of your clients use uh, as a page builder by themselves. Uh, since two years old, all of them. So. Yes, from the version second, uh, I suppose that all all my clients use this, <coughs> only this. Most mostly use only this, and they are very very happy. Of course, there are clients who never will uh, update or even go to uh, CMS, but they want to CMS very very hard. Sometimes I need the CMS, uh, and I ask them. What for? How, yes, uh, how many? Uh, how 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 much uh, you want to pay? Very, very little. Okay. Uh, for what for you, you need CMS? 
uh, maybe I will add some content about how in often. Years. One, one, maybe two times in year. <laughs> yes, yeah, so, but this is depends, of course. I hope the new clients uh, who has websites in the past and now they're looking for the new opportunity or new tool, it will grab this and will be very, very happy. Uh, Is it a good solution for uh, uh, a website where uh, you publish a lot of uh, articles? Uh, it's not designed for this. Like yeah, this is this most, mostly for the, uh, I think it can be used. But in this part when uh, you're not publishing articles, for example, uh, you have uh, all the pages, many items uh, uh, built with page builder and, and the section section blog one. will okay. be classic one. Yes, so okay. you can choose to use article in the page builder mode or the classic one. Okay. So yeah, mm -hmm. the limitation is that um, the current uh, current uh, version doesn't allows you to. Uh, show the content from the page builder inside a uh, model which show you the news. It's only okay. YouTube titles. We yeah, yes, yeah, but we are working to, to improve this and yeah. we have very, very lots of plans to do this. Uh, if I have a search module integrated on the website and um, uh, what, what does it find? Does it find the the content of the Joomla page or, or also the special code you have to uh, design the page? If you are looking, uh, if you're clicking search, yes? No. Yeah, uh, if I get a list of uh, articles, I, yes, I, I do a search for articles. Yes, yes, articles if, I, if I remember yeah. right, uh, I, I'm very sure that it will show you at least title of the Item and probably, uh, but I'm not sure. I will check maybe about the content. Yes, about the content, but it can search, but I'm not oh. sure it can be showed in highlighted words. I as I suppose I have to check because okay. there was last update and I didn't check all the uh, Change changes. Yes, I have this on the list to improve it, but I, I suppose that if this is not in the current version, in the next version will be improved because. It, is, it was very high on the list to do. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So, and if I have more languages on it, is there a way to uh, to do it? <laughs> um, yes. It's no problem. I think uh, because you have all the pages in the one component. So in most cases, you don't have to use any articles anymore. Uh, you can use articles only for the blog section, for example, news section, and this, this, and all the pages li like are static, for example, yeah. Okay. So, uh, page page builder was created for the mostly for the small pages, uh, where the user want to create a different layout with different views, and uh, he don't want to spend time or money. Uh, to, uh, to changing models each time, uh, to setting where the models might be and how it works. And using this tool, you can see each 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 page like it is on the front. So yeah, yes. and you can edit from the front end, which is for clients is the best solution because they don't touch back end, and they pay you for the updates only. <laughs> yeah. Of course, you have to do updates at least Joomla <laughs> to be secure. And hopefully, uh, we didn't ha have any hack attack uh, during during the page builder, so it's safe. Yes, it was some, some test to test that it is best the best secure set solution as on the market. So yes, we we had clients who has site was hacked, but not from the page builder. So probably they had a login admin <laughs> or something <laughs> else. Yes, still. yes, we can we can we can fight with this, but, but it's still dragon <laughs> to fight. <laughs> it's very hard. And I think that's all. I have a question. Ah, okay, please. Uh, what with additional data like micro data or aria? Like it was on previous game, that you can enter it. There is uh, some visibility. Yes. Or you need ab ab about usability, we will uh, we will 
uh, be focused next month. But right now you can add some uh, for the uh, search engines. So yes, we have the plans, for example, to improve uh, usability as well because the, the most the clients are asking for this. Yes. yes so first we had to improve some uh, technical aspect of the code to make it faster. And now we can focus on the, the basic layers for, for usability and uh, to improve uh, accessibility, yes, because uh, if you are building website for the government, you have to do this. And if you are building site for the people, even normal people, yes, yes, yes they are, they are, each are. each people, I think, is uh, during the statistic uh, over. Seven, uh, seventeen percent people have something with the eyes. So yes. there's something because we have time as we have. So yeah, even I sometimes have the problem to have to wear my glasses. Or seventeen, or 17 hours of coding. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> Just uh, your question is: Is there any advantage to use your framework? Uh, template framework or you, you can use Helix as well but you don't have to yeah I don't have to but um, the, so it's more co compact the code uh, or what are the engine images or what does it matter uh, it doesn't matter it, 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 it could the next version should if be much much a much faster new theme or other framework it doesn't it matter a, yes because this, this it was built on different uh, libraries, JavaScript, so it doesn't beat its, itself. So you can use Gantry as well, or JT3, uh, or basic uh, layout based, uh, based on your idea, and doesn't have to be a Helix or any, any other. Because less code means faster site, yes? So if you don't need any framework advanced with the fancy uh, yes. buttons features maybe very very basic uh, you can use this uh, relax <laughs> you can have only one at, at, you can yes only one uh, position component <laughs> yeah. and the layout only <laughs> this <laughs> yes and the menu you yes you need logo uh, position maybe for for the menu or built in the template to be faster and the component uh, request and that's all. Uh, all rest you can uh, build in the page builder. Okay. I can show you later <laughs> if you want. Okay. I so write it already. Okay. Okay. Great. So you can put a component inside the uh, page builder. No, no. You right. You because no, this is this is uh, uh, Joomla doesn't allows you to use the components inside. Uh -huh. okay. By default, of course. We don't talk about hacks. Uh, uh, so. Yes, we have plans to implement, to show artic uh, article view from the page builder, but it doesn't make sense. Uh, I, s I saw the people that are asking for to show the shop, shop uh, component inside page builder, but I think this doesn't make sense because Joomla have to, uh, to, to request uh, first uh, page builder, what for, <laughs> and this shop, okay. So you want to use shop or page builder if you want to use uh, part of the page builder design you can use module yes, yes, yes. yes. You can, you can put inside can yes you can use yes. Yeah. yes but in most cases you, you don't have to use this so if you want to shop you will shop yes okay Thanks. more requests slower site yes, 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 yes. yes. <laughs> okay Okay, thank you so much. <laughs>